Buckle up, future engineers. We're diving into the world of aircraft construction. Fasten your seatbelts for a quick tour. First up, the truss structure. Imagine a skeleton made of steel tubes arranged in triangles. Think of early birds like the Piper Cub. Next, the monocoque structure. Here, the skin does all the heavy lifting like a soda can holding pressure. Early racers like the Depardussin use this style. Then, there's the semi-monocoque structure. It's like a team effort. Stressed skin and internal frames share the load. Modern jets like the Boeing 737 use this method. Moving on to composite structures, where advanced materials like carbon fiber create strong lightweight planes. The Boeing 787 Dreamliner is a prime example. Geodesic structures weave a lattice of intersecting members, creating a super strong basket-like frame. Two's Vickers Wellington Bomber rock this design. And lastly, sandwich structures, a lightweight core sandwiched between strong sheets like a high-tech Oreo. Found in modern aircraft ray domes and panels, each type has its perks, chosen for weight, strength, and cost. And that's your crash course in aircraft construction.